Okay, here we are again, Copper Gardens, Dave Burns here. We're taking a final look today at um, the bit of work we did to reorganize the color. Organize? Yeah, reorganize the color on these um, sconce covers. Um, it's kind of a small story that had a kind of a larger uh, backstory, I guess, uh, is the best way to put it. And I'm doing this only because I did the first two videos and I sent the client a picture of these just like this. Then my GoPro came back to life. All of this is more story than you need, but this is what I um, this is what I do. I just <laughs> I just tell you my failures, my mistakes, my happy days, and everything. So this is a final look at the color. I think we have it in a good spot. What I can tell you is this: at one point I got a very uh, monotone finish, kind of this green right in here and here bits of it all over and it was just almost like i painted it and it looked phony it didn't quite give me the um the true look of um of natural aging of course it is not natural this was a forced um, chemistry project and um it is what it is but but this kind of look is more natural when i see older copper things out in the world in various places I found a um, old um, cattle feeding thing here about uh, about a mile from my home a few years ago, and I used that. I referred to that as a um, kind of a cornerstone of my coloring because it had this kind of a look. It was very mottled, different types of greens all over it, and it looked good to me. Of course, I cut it all up and made something else out of it, possibly ruined it in the eyes of everybody else in the world. Anyway, that's the short story. That's all I would need to say today. Here's where they are, and we're going to ship them up. I, I, well, I'm actually waiting for a, approval of the client that they're going to like it as they are. Um, I hope they do. If they don't, we'll fudge it a little more and see what we come up with. But this is where we're at. Okay? Thanks for looking, you guys. I appreciate it.